Hey, what's up, YouTube? This Enoch come back with another video. All right, so I just seen the number eleven eleven, so I posted this video. But yeah, let's talk about it. All right, so you want to awaken, right? Go into the fifth dimension. Open your third eye, your first eye, pineal gland. Go up in consciousness. The way you can do that is by going inside of yourself, releasing the demons that's in you. Let's keep it real. Nobody is perfect. People mess up all the time, mistakes, life. To live means evil, backwards, whatever you want to call it. Even love, evil. But anyways, you heard this before. Other people, not just from me. You ever heard somebody say, I have to get these demons out of me? That's true. The place you live in now is very wicked and somewhat a form of hell, but you don't know that. So, it's technically a prison planet at this point. Certain people are waking up now, but we are still quarantined by the gods and the goddesses until we rise. Captivity is what we are in. But anyways, you have to let go the emotions you have, any kind of hate, negative thoughts, just let it flow through your body and go out you like taking a shower. You got to understand that everyone is equal. So no one is better than you, no matter the person. And everyone has problems. They are just not showing it. If you want to rise in consciousness, go inside yourself. Swallow your pride. Become humble. Don't be jealous. A messed up individual. Release those demons. That is holding you back. Keeping you stuck in a third dimensional thinking. That this matrix created. To trap you. Reincarnation is real. If you don't wake up. In a sand. Move up, feel dimension, realize what's going on around you, what happened, you will come back over and over. I don't want to come back here. I might just have fun, but I want to go up, not down where this is going. But nobody perfect, man. A lot of people did wicked things. I done a couple bad things, you know, but we make mistakes. We are in human bodies, but we are spiritual beings. So with that being said, it's going to be a certain point when you wake up. 
and you realize you are more than the body, the vehicle. That is what it is, a vehicle you move around in. In your soul, in your conscience, personality goes with you. So you must know you create. You have help. The creator is very real. If you want to call him God, he is real. And I know that. Raw. Ran. But anyways, let go. Toxic relationships. Bad people. Snakes. Some people are demons themselves. Believe it or not. You might be sitting next to one. So, even parasites. They take over human bodies. And try to stop you. Because of your light. But you have to go inside yourself. Get the wickedness out. Focus on positivity. And manifesting your best version of yourself. Everyone is equal. Unity is in the fifth dimension. Love is in the fifth dimension. To awaken your third eye, you have to go inside. Find a quiet space. Clear your mind. You can sit Indian style with your head down, eyes closed, in the, in the grass, whatever. And you can do that for 10 minutes. Then try putting, facing your head upwards while the sun is out in the daytime, of course. With your eyes closed. And let the sun hit your face. And when it hits your face. You're going to see red with your eyes closed. And what that is doing is stimulating your pineal gland to open. So if you. Just believe in the process. And you do this. And commit to it. Eat right. Good habits. Get rid of. Bad food. Fluoride. You'll be alright. It will naturally open. But when you meditate. That makes you a more advanced. Being. And you get. Information. Constantly. Continuously. So, it never stops. Your conscience is never ending. Never ending story. And you have to get no demons out of you. That's the only way that you can go up into the fifth dimension and pass that. And you just got to let go of the past and focus on the future and what's to come. So... With that being said, you know, just love yourself for who you are. Uh, just appreciate you being here because it is enough. You are living in a important time and you are creating history right now. So with that being said, just motivate yourself, uh, have confidence and be around positive people. If you are not around positive people, be by yourself. It's okay. The smartest people are alone. The most conscious people are alone. Spiritual gurus, Buddhas, things like that. But that's it. 
I wanted to make a video about um you have to get the demons from out of you if you want to go up into the fifth dimension. This Enoch, I'll holler at y'all later. Peace.